you don't want to be appearing to work and to life with the same hairstyle over and over and over. I don't like looking the same way every single day. I like to change my style. So I don't like doing a hairstyle that commands me to be stuck in one look. Because we don't need everybody in the world knowing that we are on a protective hair challenge. Like, we don't have to look like what we're going through. Hi, 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 hi. Hello, welcome to the Zenkari YouTube channel. It's another video and it's time for me to show you something really cool and exciting about hair using my hair as the news. If you're not subscribed, please subscribe to the Zenkari YouTube channel. So today I'm alone at home and I have energy, like I'm in the mood. I am energetic today. Sorry that my fingers are orange. I was eating cheese balls before I started this video so you can understand that I'm having a sugar rush so um if you've watched the video I made about um this protective hairstyle I've had this protective hmm. I've had this protective hairstyle in for about three weeks now my goal is to get to at least four weeks and then if I can get to like the fifth week the sixth week I'll be really really proud of myself because me I like to touch my hair <laughs> but I really need to leave my hair alone for my hair to grow so that's not what this video is about so today I'm going to be showing you how I style this hair as it gets old because we don't need everybody in the world knowing that we are on a protective hair challenge like we don't have to look at what we're going through so I'm just going to be showing you how I upgrade um, my style and how I wear it throughout the week on different days of the week just how I pack the hair in a way that still looks presentable so if you're interested in that don't go anywhere so for style number one this is actually how I wear the hair most of the time I'm sure you're noticing like this one is longer than the rest just come down on a normal day it's actually the same length but the beauty about this hairstyle is it's very dynamic like i can um change the length of the hairstyle if i want it to be longer bob i can do that but then i really like i like my hair short so i particularly made this side longer because of i have been wearing my hair in a side part let me just show you like this is like this is like the simplest um way that i've been wearing my hair so i just put it like to the side and I, sometimes i like to show my ears so this is like this is style number one <laughs> yeah still cute but then i still do something extra so i like to go in with um hair accessories so sometimes i can just like stick one of my flowers in and then it's like really cute i think it's really cute yeah so sometimes i put in most of the time i put in a hair accessory and then i just rock my hair like this and then i i, I don't I don't really i don't i don't gel my edges I don't gel my edges. My edges don't gel, so I just sleep in like this. But what I do is I sleep with a scarf, right? I go to bed with a scarf. So what that does is it actually presses down my flyaways. So most of the time when I wake up, my hair is actually laid, as laid as I need it to be. But then I do do something. I do do something. I use a brush just to like make my edges smoother. I'm, I'm looking for my brush right now, and it's not a hair brush. It's an old touch brush. Recycle, reuse. Yes, here is my beautiful, durable, format with brush, now hair brush. So I just brush my edges just a little, nothing too much. We accept our hair. We, we, we are the queen of rough hair. We own the roughness. And rough is not rough. Rough is, 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 is a style. Like, my hair is not rough. This is just the style of my hair. Like, let me say the truth. Me, I actually call myself the queen of rough hair. Like, I've accepted it. <laughs> I don't lay my edges. I don't try to get my hair to look straight, well pressed down, or well behaved. This is the way my hair likes to be. And me and my hair have come to a point of understanding and compromise. And really, I don't see anything wrong with it. I just feel like others may think my hair is rough, but I think my hair is beautiful. So, this is what I do. And this is how I've been working it for a very long time but then this afternoon i just came up with another style so let me show you how that one works Aha, so this is actually an old wig cap that got opened at the end so then i, I use this to hold my hair so another way i could style my hair is to just pack it So 
I start catching really loosely. We're not trying to pull on our edges. This is a protective style. We want our edges free and growing. We want our ends tucked in and growing. But then, just because I'm bending down my head a lot at work, and yeah, we don't want that. This we don't want this happening. I secure it with one of these guys. I got this pin from AliExpress before we started having like restrictions on the Naira and all of that. I'm so happy that I got this when I did. So I just look for a very good spot and then put this in. So when I bend, look at nothing happens when I turn. It stays in place so I can be free as far as I want to be while I'm at work. If you want to go further, you could also like pin, pin this up, you know just give it like an extra updo because you don't want to be appearing to work and to life with the same hairstyle over and over and over personally me i get tired like i don't like looking the same way every single day i like to change my style so i don't like doing a hairstyle that commands me to be stuck in one look that's one of the reasons why i probably won't get dreads i look at people's dreads and i think man those dreads are really nice but I feel like if I dread my hair, it's going to be locked. It's called locking. I lock my hair and I'm, I don't have access to my hair anymore. And I love touching my hair. So yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's, uh, I digress. So I don't like having one style for too long. I like to switch up my style. So you could do this. And of course, you could be the hair accessory. Can you imagine? This is so cute. <laughs> Why didn't we put two? This is so cute. This fact, I think this is this is how I'm wearing my hair to work tomorrow. You know, this was going to come out this cute. Like I was thinking about ways to style my hair, and I was like, oh, why don't you turn on the camera and create styles as you go? But this is really cute that I just like came up with you right now. This is cute. This is how I'm going to wear my hair to work next. Apart from looking good, I did this hairstyle because I want to, I want to gain length and I want to reach my hair goal which is butt length and it's attainable because I've seen a lot of other naturals that have reached butt length so I know that my hair can go that long. This style gives me like an endless platform for me to create so many other styles. That's why I really like it. That's why it's my go-to protective hairstyle. So it's the wrap. I will be back again for watching. See you in my next video. Au revoir. Mwah. <laughs>